Today on Toy Shiz, I just scored three red shells, and I am coming for you. Let's talk toys. Welcome back, everyone. Toy Shiz here, and I am back yet again to give you guys another fresh look. And today, we are totally checking out the brand new Mario Kart Spin Out Luigi and Spin Out Mario from Jack Specific. Starting off with Luigi. He is giving me the serious stare down right now. Luigi, in all his Mario Kart glory, comes with a... Banana, or peeled banana, banana man, whatever you want to call him. Mario Kart artwork adorns the box. Very cool. And I actually like the way this package is. Yes, it's wide open. Kids can mess around with it in the store if you really want to. The backside shows you exactly what the cart does. And that the cross-sell is Mario as well. Here's the barcode. I picked mine up from Target. They are hitting now, along with Mario. Spin out Mario Kart. Same exact deal as Luigi. Really nice packaging. Overall, you get to see the back side. So basically, it does the whole video game thing. When you hit a banana, it spins out. Here's the barcode for Mario as well. Not very excited about this. This is fun. I love Jack Specific's Mario toys, especially when they incorporate game mechanics into them. So sit back, relax, fire off that blue shell right before your opponent crosses that finish line. This is a look at the brand new Nintendo's Spin Out Luigi Kart and Spin Out Mario Kart by Jack Specific. And of course, here's Mario Mario and Luigi Mario taken out of the packaging. There's a banana, and Luigi's still giving me the stare down. And yes, these are very well done. And each of them come with the banana. And essentially, he's going to be the obstacle in the road that makes you spin out. Just like in the video game. And as such, like most Jack Specific Mario products, looks like he was banana slipped, peeled, whatever, right out of the video game. Luigi... You, here's the best thing about this Luigi for just these purposes. You can recreate that Mario Kart meme where he goes all slow driving by. That's amazing. <laughs> oh, yeah, he's also a toy, too. We can talk about that. Basic articulation in the head. And then on the underside is the mechanism, right? And I'll show you all that in just a second. The tires spin. There's no other articulation, let's say, in the steering wheel or the hands. It's just very basic. The backside and the front is what activates the mechanism. On Mario, you can tell he's very bright, very colorful, very cool. Same exact type of mechanism on the bottom, but just very crisp. It's oh so cool. He's got head articulation as well. Eh, a couple paint slippages here and there on the backside, but overall, really nicely done. Now, you're probably wondering, okay, so show us this. What's, what's going to be happening here? Well, I set up a patented mario kart level and somebody's been throwing bananas again right probably donkey kong so what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your mario character and see this little dial right here you got arrows and everything so it's pretty foolproof you spin this till you can't spin it no more and then you just kind of work it so that you can push it up it clicks in the back and the front are what you're going to aim for and hit to really activate this so we'll see if we get on the first try three two one and go and it did it! <laughs> Heck yeah! I had to do that a couple times to get that on camera, just FYI. But, yes, it works. It's cool. I'll show you a couple caveats to the whole situation. You can do this, where you crash into each other. That works as well. See, it, there's lots of different ways to have fun with this. But in either sense, it looks like you're playing Mario Kart. You can even set up Bowser. He's the one that's been throwing bananas. Here, we thought it was Donkey Kong, right? That didn't work. <laughs> It doesn't always work, all right? So you kind of have to hit a wall in that sense or just have the banana hit it. Here's Luigi again, man. What is his deal? Now, as far as the scaling goes for these, I would love if Jack Specific made just the Mario Kart carts and you could put the 4-inch figures on it or the 2.5-inch figures, which you could see all the scaling, right? They're big, they're small, they all fit. Mario stuff just all kind of fits together. And I have a large collection of various companies Mario stuff so yeah you can use it with this like the giant egg from Mario Kart 64 right or the coins you're gonna collect coins or hit the shells basically in SNES it all works and it's fun this is a very cool very fun toy based on a Nintendo property that perfectly recreates the whole video game experience in real life and there goes Luigi again, man. <laughs> like I said, you could give yourself a trophy, maybe across the finish line. Kids can have a blast with this. I'm having a blast with this. Luigi's mad mugging. 
it's cool. These are very fun toys. I like that they come with the giant banana. That's a lot of fun as well. As I'll say, I feel like the banana could have been a little bit heavier, a little bit more weighted down. When you hit the banana peel with the Mario Kart, it won't always work. Sometimes if you hit it, the little mechanism will go off before it gets a chance to really hit the ground and make you spin. So it pretty much works all of the time, but those are little inconsistencies here and there. It's all about how you hit it and if you hit it just right. If you have a bunch of different Mario Nintendo toys, I'm sure you could find something or hey, a good old fashioned wall or the leg of a couch will work just fine but i am curious to know what you guys think about these new mario kart toys are they for you will you be grabbing comment below let me know let's talk everything jack specific mario figures so i'm gonna leave you guys with that as always drink some great coffee eat some great food but most importantly remember jacks again if you ever just want to make the mario karts themselves put the figures on there just like the old toy biz days yeah that's what i'm looking for and when you do let me know what you found i'll talk to you guys soon adios